This is Big Mama. Big Mama is a Chinese mantis. Jenna, a lovely follower, reached out recently and asked to have Big Mama memorialized. Jenna wanted Big Mama pinned with her wings fully extended, which is always a really fun process. I had never handled a mantis this big in my life before, so it was really exciting to see an animal like this in person, despite them not being alive. Because I'm going to be pinning Big Mama's wings, I created a foam board with a divot in the center so that the wings would be resting on a flat surface, or as close to a flat surface as I could make. When pinning wings, you also have to be really careful of the pins underneath them. You really have to push those pins all the way into that foam board so that when you do pin the wings, they don't hit the pins that are sticking out. Big Mama was actually stored in a freezer for about a year, and I'm really happy to say that there wasn't really much um, freezer burn on her. This is a great example of when stored properly, specimens can be kept in the freezer for quite a while. When pinning insect wings, I really like to avoid going through the wings themselves. Even when you're using a super thin pin, you can kind of see a little hole in the wing. Wax paper is definitely one of my best friends when pinning insects. It's great for propping up certain body parts and also wrapping around the wings. The wax paper enables me to position the wings and then pin around them to keep them in place. I'm using tweezers here to position the wings even more so that they're slightly raised up above the ground. After two weeks, Big Mama was fully dry. So I carefully removed all of the pins and made sure her wings were in place. She is just a stunning animal. Look at her little face. She's just so cute. I framed Big Mama up today and she is going to go on her journey back to her loved ones. Hopefully it's the safest journey possible. And thank you again, Jennifer, for trusting me with your beloved pet.